moving forward, what would you like to see? Uh, I went around the states um, and the schools. The schools, I have not enough words to describe how very, how very pleased I was with uh, the state of the schools. The, the schools are very wonderful. They are, they are extremely wonderful. And I am very proud that my state actually has one of the one of the most beautiful schools in the country. We need to get more from them. In terms of the IGR, I I hundred percent agree that more needs to be done by the states so that we can uh, be able to stand alone and uh, in case uh, because of the oil issue and all that, so we can stand alone and know this is our own money that we generate from the inside. All right, guys, that will be all. Thanks for coming on the program and sharing your thoughts. We'll take a quick break, and when we return, we'll take a few messages coming through our social media platforms and also review the most viewed videos on our YouTube channel in the past week. Please stay with us. Pain is part of gain. No pain, no gain. Years of wasting. This week's top five videos begins with that of former running mate to President Muhammadu Buhari on the platform of the defunct CPC, Tunde Bakare, urging Nigerians to be patient with the president. I will want to appeal to all Nigerians that we should just exercise a bit of patience. This change will not become chain that will tie all of us down. If you have grievances that are channels of um, uh, venting, letting, so grievances. And, uh, the video of the Ondo State APC chairman clearing the air on the alleged imposition of a governorship candidate in the state for the next election is up next in fourth place. Taking the third spot, a leader of the PDP insisting that the party had a legal convention. You had a convention. Had a convention today at the party secretariat. But that, is that legal? It is very legal. It's only the venue that was we didn't use. But we because the security agencies see it. Ali Modu Sharif was hammering on one issue. That while in second is a PDP chieftain, Chief Body George explaining how Senator Ali Modu Sharif became the party chairman of Nigeria's leading opposition party. This is how the ministry had been held hostage 
by some form of manipulations. And taking the first spot is Nigeria's sports minister, Solomon DeLong, saying the Atlanta issue with the under-23 squad was a hoax. Well, there you go. Those were the most viewed videos on our YouTube channel in the past week. However, 25 years, even in a human being's life, is a number where one is supposed to have achieved some life goals while trying to attain other set goals. The states celebrating this milestone may yet not be the El Dorado their citizens and residents want them to be, but with time, all might just fall in place. And that's the program this week. Thank you for watching. I'm Victor Mathias, and do also remember that the conversation continues online via the addresses showing on your screen. Goodbye.